strap it on it. All right, everybody, here we are, Dale Ethridge Auto and Performance again. We're about to take it for its first run. There it is. Let's crank it up. Tiki girl enjoying it. It's so different than the diesel. Wow, it's whoa. Yeah. Yeah, that was <laughs> that was 30 miles an hour. And I know 30 miles an hour isn't fast, but to get there, it's just so much less effort. Let's see, we're at 194 degrees. You got the mechanical fan. We ended up putting on it. I'll try to go to an electric one later. Um, so I'm just going to start down at the hill here. The throttle is obviously a lot different um, when you get used to that diesel. It's much snappier. So let's see. We're at uh, 196. It's still learning that Holly Sniper Kit. Um, Still learning. What's weird is when I let off the brake, I let off the brake and it just it rolls. You know, before you could let off the brake and just sit there. So let's see. Whoa! That is that is insanity! Insanity! <laughs> wow! literally drives like a modern modern truck the pickup is phenomenal wow yeah worth every penny worth every penny I'm gonna take it down there again a 197 man this thing that's a whole different world I'll be right back good video but uh I don't really care like the, the throttle is so much just snappier wow yeah yeah I'm pretty uh pretty blown away right now Let's see. I'm going to switch it around on us. That is amazing. Absolutely amazing. Let's just go to... Uh... Yeah. That thing is sucking air. That's that noise. It's that throttle body. Wow. Yeah, man, way, way better, way, way worth it. <laughs> Runs great. Oh, man, that is phenomenal. All right, I'm out of here. All right, so that was uh, kind of loud and chaotic, a little crazy. It's kind of like a kid at Christmas unwrapping gifts. That was awesome. That really was. That truck is 100% different acts different uh it's it startled me first when i hit the gas and it kind of kicked me back a little bit i'm just not used to that um 
You know, I'm coming from the 6.2 naturally aspirated military diesel, and it was the original 1992 diesel. So that thing was, what, 25 years old? Um, so yeah, man, this was well worth the investment. It's it's uh, it's going to be a great great swap. It really is. I can't wait. I, I've got to wait a couple more days. They're going to button some stuff up, and I can go get it for good. Take it back. Put the hood on it. I'm going to wire up the rest of the 24 volt stuff. But uh, he got rid of. I remember in the last video I talked about a little bit of a, um, a a spark issue. You could hear it in the motor, and that ended up just being a loose spark plug wire. Spark plug wire was loose on the plug, and he unhooked it hooked it back in runs great that holly system when you tick it to ignition when you when you get the starter and just kind of click it once to turn everything on you wait for that holly sniper to make a little click and that's the injectors just doing a little squirt and once they've done that man it cranks right up uh ran great again the the, the response of the motor um was phenomenal it was really loud because obviously i'm probably 12 inches from the throttle body and that LS motor is moving a lot of air. And with that uh, filter that was on it, that's temporary. I'm gonna get back to the actual um, somewhat watertight housing with a four inch pipe to the, uh, to the um, what's it called, the snorkel. And so once I put all that back together, put the doghouse on it, I'll be interested to see how loud it is. But I think, I mean, I know it's gonna be a lot quieter than a diesel, especially at higher RPM. But uh, man, I'm excited. So subscribe to the channel, stay tuned. We're gonna do a lot once we get that Hummer back. We've got a lot of really cool stuff coming, a lot of plans for it. We gotta get the electrical stuff kind of rewired a little bit to make it a little bit more waterproof. Um, but yeah, subscribe to the channel. I'll be posting the next one hopefully Monday or Tuesday when I actually go pick it up and drive it back with no hood on it. So that'll be fun. Um, but I appreciate y'all watching. Have a good one.